hello family welcome back again to my channel if you're new guys consider subscribing if you're my returning subscriber thank you so much for always coming back to support me i do really appreciate guys on this channel i always share my experience as a housemate i take you through the work that i do as a housemate working in the uae it's a beautiful morning guys and the kitchen is my first office when i wake up in the morning so today i woke up i made my breakfast and after making the breakfast i'm now here washing the utensils that i used for making the breakfast and then of course if you finish cooking as a woman you have to arrange your kitchen and leave it when it's totally clean so as i'm washing these plates or as i'm cleaning the utensils today guys i want to share with you some of my best moments that i have enjoyed as a proud housemaid are uh, working in the uae as a proud housemaid who has worked for a period of four years in one house for sure i'm just on my countdown my contract is coming to an end i'm just counting days to go back home it means i'm on my last days <laughs> of being with my arab family the family that have enjoyed along all this period when i was coming uh, from my home country to come work as a housemaid i never knew that god was leading me to such a peaceful family a loving family and a caring family but it's my opportunity today guys to share with you the experience that i have experienced as a proud housemaid when i joined this family you know when you're joining a new environment of course you should expect some little little challenges until when you get used to that environment or you get to the characters of the environment the behaviors and so on and so forth so when i joined this family i had some little challenges being it that i was a new person in a new family uh, but later on as i kept on staying with them i coped up with their behaviors i coped up with their manners and i coped up with their characters uh, i learned their um, don'ts and wants eh? don'ts and wants i think so when i learned how to handle this family and when i learned to handle each and everybody uh, starting from the elder one to the young one life became easy for me to stay with my arab family my arab family has showed me maximum care maximum respect and maximum love that every kadama every house helper every domestic worker outside there would wish to enjoy when i discuss with some of my friends who are working in different arabic countries in different houses when we come to the point of sharing our experiences you find that most of my friends cry a lot because of the life that they are living in because of the way they are being treated where they are working I can't say uh, all our um, employers are good. We have those who are good and we have those who 
are not good. The same to our country back home in Uganda. We have those people who are good to others and we have those people who are not good to others. What have I enjoyed in this family? When it comes to caring, they have cared for me. They have provided me every basic needs that I deserve as a housemaid. Dressing, eating, I don't know how even I can describe this family, guys. Sometimes when I say I'm going to talk about it, I just get out of words because the words to describe this family are endless. They are endless. But only what I can tell you, God led me to a loving family. The four years I have finished in this house, I have achieved a lot of things. Uh, first of all, the money that they have been paying me has helped me to construct shelter home for my uh, family. This same money has helped me to educate my son, to educate my siblings. And this same money has also helped me myself as a human being to invest in some of my properties. I'm owning a piece of land just from the money that I have been getting or earning here in my boss's house. My siblings are speaking English my siblings are at school because of the money that I'm earning here in my boss's house. My son is at school. He has never been chased away from school because of the money that I'm earning here in this house. Who am I not to appreciate my Arab family? When I was in Uganda, guys, whenever I could see people going for outings, I used to call it wastage of money. Little did I know that people in life have to enjoy. Little did I know that it was poverty that was making me to think like that. But when I came here, I have visited many places that I had never even wished or had a dream to visit in my life. First of all, when I was in Uganda, when I used to hear about I, like the zoo, I just used to read about the zoo in history, in HST, about the wild animals. But when I reached here, I was taken to the zoo and I had to see the animals with my naked eyes. Those good, good places where to spend leisure from. I have enjoyed expensive places. So, guys, let me tell you, I'm going home soon. Okay, but I'm going to miss my Arab family. Though, I have that mind of coming back, but the period I will finish in my vacation. I'm going to miss this family a lot. My Baba is such a kind man who always wakes up in the morning and checks on his mates. How have they slept? He's a kind man who always asks his mates how, whether they have eaten or not. Uh, he's a kind man who knows that his mates also get tired. They need to rest. The only wish I can wish my boss is I pray to the Lord to grant him with many more years. And I pray to the Lord that every maid 
who will come in this house in future when I'm away enjoys the love that I have enjoyed in this house. When I was in Uganda, I never knew how to put on an expensive cloth. But when I reached in this house, I have 